All right, so doing a video on another part of Five Points, we've done several, um, but this area of Five Points is more central. This is sort of the area that is behind the fire station. This is gonna be more your traditional Five Points location. Some of the street names you wanna think about are Millage Circle. We're currently on Westview, about to merge with Millage Circle. Uh, Stanton Way, Woodlawn, Rutherford. Those are uh, McWhorter, Highland. These are the street names that are associated with this part of town. So where I am right now is I'm almost directly behind the firehouse in Five Points. So this is a very walkable location. And you know, the word walkable, I don't even think it's really a word, but it's become very popular uh, nomenclature, so to speak, in real estate, especially here in Athens. The Five Points area that we're in now, you have a lot of these homes that are very central and are easily walkable, so to speak, to uh, Earth Fair, to get a cup of coffee, to go to a restaurant, to go to a bar. They're close to UGA's campus. You can walk to a baseball game. You can walk to a basketball game. And they're just a more classic part of town. They're, this is not the oldest part of town, but it's, it's one of the older parts of town. And it's got a lot of great, uh, diverse architecture. So you're going to find, you know, you might find a Tudor home, a Georgian, a uh, contemporary. There's just a lot of different type of homes you might run into here. And as you might have noticed, if you've seen any of their videos, it has been a trend in our marketplace to see a lot of renovation and activity going on. And that is very much the case in all points of Five Points, this part especially. So I did one video that we talked about the University Drive area and values could exceed 250 a square foot if they've been renovated. And that's true here same thing we're now on stanton way and you see there's a smaller home and as we approach we're coming up to woodlawn where if you uh can find larger homes uh located here that could exceed a million dollars so this entire area is um diverse in what you might find price point as well but it has a very high level that could get over a million dollars depending on the size and the uh, finished value of the property so I think Five Points for a lot of folks just looks like that traditional Americana style neighborhood. So I talked about with all the other types of architecture and it just kind of has this tree lined streets. It's close into town. There's a lot of things that anybody new to town might like about it. But one thing for certain is that people uh, that went to school here love the Five Points area. I think if you attended the University of Georgia, there's always a place in your heart for this area of town. And I came this way to kind of show you just how close it was to Millage Avenue. As I come here, we're now on Millage Avenue, which is a major thoroughfare here in Athens. You've got sorority uh, houses, fraternity houses. You've also got a uh, business district where our office, Five Mark, is located on South Millage and Cloverhurst. I uh, just passed a chiropractor and a fraternity house. This road will head right into the first major area of Five Points. And then um, you turn here on the Great Street Woodlawn. It's an evidence, directly right here in front of us is evidence of a great home that's recently been renovated and built. Um, historic preservation in the back and then a new home built in the front. And this is a little small uh, historic district, Woodlawn, right here in the center of town where it's got some older homes, very classic feel. And directly across the street is one of our very popular restaurants, Five and 10, uh, back there the way we just came. So that's an example of, from right here, you could literally tailgate for a Georgia football game, uh, walk to the game, come home with your friends, and then walk to dinner. And that's what people are paying for here. It's really about the location over anything else because you cannot replicate the proximity of uh, these locations to where people are trying to go and do things. And as the rule applies in real estate, location, location, location. And like a lot of the Five Points area, this is zoned for Barrow Elementary which is one of our popular elementary schools, really close to the Budsmere and the athletic department. But this is a good glimpse of what the traditional Five Points area looks like and what the home values could be. If you have any interest, feel free to look us up at 5mrealty.com or you can always download our app, Google Play Store or the iStore. And just look up Five Market Realty in either one of those stores.